back in the day, loads of people used to have this, but it just, he actually got the worst stick for it. I think it's a bit unfair. I don't think his hair was that outlandish, but the song caught on, of course, um, uh, and that's what he was remembered for. And, you know, he's quite a good player, but no one ever remembers that. It's remember the fact that he had a pineapple on his head. So you've got to, you've got to feel for him. He just used to be always bouncing around. So I think as a centre half trying to defend against him, you'd, you'd get his hair in your eye. And it was probably a, a good weapon for him, the style of his hair. How can you not love a mullet? I mean, Francis is the godfather of mullets with that. And, and I love the fact that he's carried on, but he's persisted with it. After all these years, still rocking the mullet. It's almost like a Mohican with long hair. Uh, and Jerry just stuck to that. Well, to this day, he still has the same haircut, which is quite amazing. Forget football as a confining context. I think Valderrama's haircut is arguably the greatest haircut of all time. You knew wherever he was on the field because of this electric hair that he had that was absolutely horrendous and um, quite, quite a magnificent footballer but unfortunately a dreadful haircut. It's just astonishing and I, hardly anyone could pull that haircut off. Valderrama manages to do it. Lucky's ability gets him out of it but it's still a ridiculous haircut. Cissé's had a few over the years, hasn't he? Always seemed to push the boundaries with hairstyles. Just when you thought you couldn't go any further, Cissé would be the one guy that said, no, no, I'll, I'll take it further. And he even brings uh, the beard into it as well. And again, Cissé's one of those people that somehow sort of pulls it off. On any other human being, but actually, that would just look utterly absurd. Cissé, he kind of gets away with it, so you've got to admire him for that. <laughs> You see, a lot of people would argue that Terebro West had a bad haircut. I'd argue the opposite, it's a great haircut. To be a, a defender and try and be taken seriously, like, you're not scary at all. You look like something out of a Monsters University, don't you? It's just, it's just ridiculous. I think he was a bit of an outrageous player as well. He's uh, kind of played off the cuff and I think he let somebody <laughs> cut his hair off the cuff as well. There was no plan into it, I don't think, so it was bad. It's it, one of those haircuts that is so bad. It's, Great.